Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Bridge Door 2 by T Chapman 500. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. A reboot version of the original map, but this but is a lot more challenging. A light bridge across the exit door blocks your way out, and you must turn it off in addition to getting the door open. This map has the ability to detect when you are trapped yourself, and it will let you out if you do so. A button has been added to the cube dropper in the main chamber just in case you need to manually respawn it, unless you're trying to respawn it to solve the test in an unintended way. And I've patched up all unintended solutions as best I can. A second trap detector has been added just in case. Here is a link to the original map. And I do have a note that says this is a reworked version of the original map, Bridge Door. Um, it's designed to be a puzzle rather than a feature showcase, but I can no longer update this map though. All right, so let's have a look and see. What we got this time, shall we? Alright. Interesting. Similar kind of thing. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, the key bomb button. Because key bomb button based testing is still an important part of science. Alright, so then we're gonna do this and this, this and this, drop down here. Uh we'll take this, put this on this button here. Okay, that opens up the other area. Good to note, I guess. Alright, let's pop save. Allows us to go back. That's probably why. Okay. I guess that's what I need to do. And then we can go back. Oh. That's death. Yeah, I didn't think about that, did I? Hmm, okay. So. Right idea up to that point. All right, you want to play like that, eh? I see your game. Ow, oh, funnel loud noises. All 
Alright, I took far too long there. Trying to figure out what it was I was going to do. So wait, have I got to time this? Okay. If that doesn't turn off, there's too much of a gap between that and that. Okay. So, let's think about this. Do that, and we do that. So I'm guessing the trapping situation, if you, if you swap the cubes, Take the other cube into there, and then recall the cube. This will shut, and you'll be trapped inside here, right? So, just for just for argument's sake, just want to just check the the whole. Anti-trapping shenanigans, that's all. That is all. I'm gonna do that. So I do that and that. Oh, well, I can't do that. Hmm. So where's the, where's the trapping come in? Because I'd have to recall that, or respawn that cube. I don't know where the trap is. I don't know. That's the only thing I could think. Hmm. Oh well. Um, let's not worry about that for now. I guess. Um, so... Now we're just going to go over here. Uh, excuse me? I do believe you should dispense me a cube. Hmm. Uh, okay. Well. I 
I guess you don't want to dispense me a cube then. That's fine. Don't play ball then. I will remove you from my Christmas card list. Um, okay, so yeah, that's the... That's the intended. Um, I mean... Yeah, I don't know how you would trap yourself or trigger an anti-trap because you could swap the cubes like I did but then you would need to get a portal in there while in there but obviously you have to pass through this fizzler here yeah, you have to pass through the fizzler so you lose the portal and then the only way to get the portal back would be to Yeah, I could come up to like as far as here, but I can't see a pole surface, so I can't get through there. So I'm not, I'm not even sure how to tra you would trick the anti-trap in this one. Uh, maybe you can let me know in the comments. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any message to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link to that is in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock, you've been awesome. See ya.